welcome to my channel so today I want to talk about something really cool okay I want to talk about affirmations okay do you know what affirmations are um, if you popped up on this video maybe you're trying to figure out what affirmations are and be which ones you can incorporate in your life and more than anything I'm just gonna add it will explain in this video the affirmations that I do and what affirmations are and how important it is to try and implement it in your life and just the changes that I'm starting to see within my life ever since I started with these affirmations so if you're new to my channel hi I welcome you and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and share and subscribe so let's get to it okay so affirmations do you know what affirmations are <laughs> for a long time I didn't know what they were and yeah life was not looking good at all so affirmations are basically words positive words that you use with regards to yourself so um the way i can explain it is that they usually will have a i am or i in front so you can say i am wisdom i am power i am strength and yeah they're positive as i said so it's it's using words in your favor and looking at yourself in a higher regard and also trying to attract things that you want in your life okay so the reason why affirmations especially specifically positive affirmations because we end up affirming things and we don't even realize it so the reason why positive affirmations are very important is that basically word is bond guys like if you know anything about the ancients or if you know anything about you know even if you have a religious background you know um even christians believe that uh the tongue is powerful okay that you can create with the tongue okay things can manifest from the mouth okay you can cast spells just using your your mouth your mouth is so powerful it's a vibration it's it's very powerful okay so and even an Afri African proverb that I, I know, it's um, in Zulu, it says, which means the mouth can create. So, I mean, it's known, it's known all over that the mouth is powerful, the tongue is powerful, it can create. So, what you actually say every day in your life can implement your life in a way whether you realize it or not you know if you say bad things about yourself which was me for a very long time in my life you know I, I never thought of myself in any positive regard I'd be like oh why did these bad things happen to me oh I have bad luck I'm this and that and what I realized is that these things would carry on and I'd be like why is this happening but end of the day what am I saying you know words are very powerful you know you're affirming to the world to the universe or to God whoever you believe in whatever you say you know what you say you can become so what I realized is that I gotta start saying good things I gotta start saying things that I want in my life in order to attract that so people have been practicing affirmations for many 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 years and it's become something quite popular right now but I just feel like from my point of view um, it's, it's helped me a lot it, it, it changes your your mindset you know especially if you someone like me didn't really have such a positive regard towards themselves you know it's, it's that platform for you to create that change you want in your life so I'm just gonna tell you the affirmations that I started using and, and why I use it and how it's helping me you know so for me I, I've had a lot of self-esteem issues so I never really saw myself as someone who's worthy or valuable and, and, and it would carry on even externally in life you know I would get the short end of the stick and it'd be like why does this always happen to me or you know I don't manifest like the, the, the ideal relationships that I would want in my life so I watched a couple of videos I got inspired a lot you know by a lot of youtubers by a lot of you know people on Instagram spiritually like spiritually based people spiritual teachers taught me a lot about affirmations I'm like okay let me start implementing this in my life so I'm just gonna give you the, the ones that I've been using especially for self-esteem you know I always affirm to myself every morning and yeah it's important to do it like when you on the right state of mind for me that's usually in the morning and at night you know just as I wake up just as I go to bed I affirm the things that I want in my life so 
uh, the affirmations that I do are number one is I love myself okay it's so important to affirm that okay because once you live in that energy once I started living in that energy like good things started coming my way I started even changing the percep my perception of myself I started accepting myself and, and really honoring myself and it's something that I struggled with for a very long time so yeah the first affirmation that I started was saying was I love myself and I'm grateful it's important to have that energy like for me I realized that I, I do have a lot of things and in order to not take things for granted you know you, you kind of have to kind of start counting your blessings and I started embodying that so I always tell myself that I'm grateful I love myself I accept myself and an important one if you're someone like me um, I, I, another affirmation I wrote was I forgive myself for my past mistakes so one thing I realized that when we don't forgive ourselves we end up living in the past and it just affects our present moment it affects our future and you don't end up going anywhere so I realized that okay some areas of my life are not really changing and I'm realizing it's because okay I haven't forgiven myself for this certain area in my life or the mistakes that I've made so I had to affirm that I had to affirm it to the universe and affirm it to myself I mean and also another affirmation that I use is I forgive others that have harmed me because even if you can forgive yourself if you can't forgive another person then you're gonna carry that energy in your life and it's gonna just work against you okay you're just gonna be attracting things that you don't want and you won't even understand why it's because really there's confliction happening in your life you know there's a lot of people living like that right now that even I was a person that was living like that there was so woe is me victim mode you hurt me you did this the world is against me and then you just keep attracting that you keep attracting that energy because that's the only thing you're stirring up so i had to just change the script for myself and that's basically what affirmations actually do you're changing the script to your life you're changing the script to your attitude you're changing the script to your life completely and through words you know so yeah, so the affirmation that I was doing just to kind of uplift myself and also just saying that I trust myself I believe in myself and really there's no way that you can do it like you don't have to really do the ones that I do you can kind of want anything analyze your life and see which ones fit and you can also go online and get some affirmation tips or guides from people you know to kind of see which ones fit in your life but you it has to also be personal to you it has to be something that you believe in so I know it might not be the first time but if you don't really believe that this is something that you it's gonna work it's not really gonna work basically so even when you're saying that affirmation you have to believe it like you don't have to scream it like I love myself but you have to believe it have that tone have that essence within you when you say it you know say it with um, I don't even know the word to say but forgive me English is not my first language but you have to have that oomph you have to have that oomph and you say you have to believe that this is true this is gonna happen for me you know and also for me like I started adding recently uh, money affirmations you know I realized that um, I've carried uh, programs in my mind about money and it's like why why did I do that you know am I worth a million yes I need to say it I need to tell myself so I tell myself every day that I, I attract money okay I am a money millionaire so I know I'm telling the universe that this is something that I can achieve it's something that I believe I'm worth and once you you, you send that signal to the universe like you are raising that energy okay so you really do have to number one as I said believe in it if you don't believe in it it's really not gonna work don't waste your time but if it's something that you want to try you mean end of the day you have nothing to lose and I can tell you from my first hand that I've changed so much ever since I started doing affirmations I've had so much have so much more love for myself I care a lot for myself I'm able to you know even do this I, I was a year ago I wouldn't even thought in my wildest dreams that I could ever open a YouTube channel or just speak to people or to pursue any type of dream or desire but ever since I started doing affirmations ever since I started believing in myself more you know like the script started changing for me I started changing even within me and you will see it you will feel it you know so it's really helped me it's really helped my life and 
if you are someone that's interested in doing affirmations like i i really advise that you start you start whatever way look it up research and even um in the description box below i'm going to just write the affirmations that i do all of them if you're interested in uh doing them as well if you want to look at your own ones but more than anything try personalize them you know let it let it be realistic to you let it be realistic to your life and another way that i also drill these affirmations because i realized more than anything the more research i've been doing with my own evolution of life um is that um we are we have a subconscious and a conscious mind so our conscious mind is the what's kind of what we how we function day to day and what we remember and everything you know but our subconscious mind is like the mind that is very present and can actually controls 95 percent of our behaviors and it's very habitual so as much as you can like watch like an inspirational video and you're like oh my gosh yeah i'm inspired i'm gonna do this and then like the next day you forget all of that stuff and you're like what what is happening to me why am i trash what is happening but the truth is that, that your subconscious mind runs the show so as much as your conscious mind saw this video once you've been inspired you have to t kind of now work with this machine that is in your brain okay this powerhouse that's in your brain that really is controlling and running your life so I, in order to do that like i had to do a lot of things i had to research about it so if you want to learn more about the subconscious mind um i'm probably going to do a video about it um because something that's also very new to me i don't want to talk too much about something that i'm not 100 percent sure and there's something i'm still implementing in my life but um yes i learned to try and reprogram and, and kind of see the programs that are running in my mind and the one thing that i said as well is that it's very habitual so you in order to start making changes in your life you have to do things in the habit you know you have to make a habit out of something and you know that habits can only really happen after doing something constantly or consecutively for an average of 28 days so what i started doing is i started uh recording myself recording my my affirmations me saying these affirmations and sleeping listening to it because once you fall asleep your conscious mind is off and then your subconscious mind is it doesn't doze off it's always present so it's going straight into your subconscious mind so i would find myself even like sitting maybe just dozed off or just doing something and i'll can, like hear the affirmations kind of playing in my head so what's good about it is that because when you your conscious mind is not really present and your your subconscious mind takes over if you have put those affirmations in and stored them into your subconscious mind and created it as a new program it's still running it's still running and it's becoming more effective so yeah learn learn things of that nature in order to implement affirmations i've, I've seen it to help me a lot you know so yeah i hope you enjoyed this video if it helped you in any way please as i said give it a thumbs up comment share and subscribe thank you for coming to my channel and good luck with your affirmations